Hi, I'm Jeremy Rigneris with SolidWorks Live at 3D Experience World 2020 in Nashville, Tennessee. This morning, we're going to have the opportunity to take a look at the SolidWorks Certification Exam Team and what's new as at 3D Experience World 2020. I'm going to get the opportunity to speak with Mike Puckett, who is the Senior Manager of SolidWorks Certifications and also a first-time attendee at 3D Experience World. Let's go take a look. I ran into Tony Foster from House of Design in, in Idaho. Tony, welcome. Thank you. So, Tony, we had an opportunity to talk a little bit before we went on camera. This is actually your first 3D Experience World you've ever been to, is that correct? That's correct. So, what made you want to come to 3D Experience World for the first time? Uh, well, I the first time I wanted to come to it was about 2006, I heard about it. And I was, at that time, enamored with SolidWorks. I had just gotten through school and learned SolidWorks and uh, just to have an opportunity to go and see all these other people that knew how to use it and learn the tools and stuff like that, it just looked like a really fun and great opportunity. Well, that's great. So we're here in the certification area, so you didn't only come here to learn, you came here to actually get certified in some of the tools. Tell us a little bit about what certifications you're planning on taking while you're here. Yeah, so today I'm gonna take the CSWP for surface modeling. Uh, it's the last one I have to take before I qualify for the expert exam. So that means you've already taken four other exams in the certified program, is that correct, on top of the normal CSWP? That's true. Wow, that's really good. So once you finish this, you'll be qualified to go take Certified SolidWorks Expert. Now, what does your employer think about this when you're coming here to get certified? You know, my employer puts a lot of weight on the certifications. Uh, we have a goal at our office to have every one of our engineers certified in SolidWorks in one form or another. Um, as of about two months ago, we have 18 or so engineers and every one of them is at least associate level. Wow, that's, that's really impressive that your company has invested that sort of resources to make sure that all the engineers are certified in SolidWorks. Tell us a little bit about what House of Design does so the folks at home, maybe they're curious what, what House of Design is. <laughs> yeah, well, it has nothing to do with houses. <laughs> well, it didn't start out that way. Um, we are a robotics integration company and we automate manufacturing processes. Uh, Project-based company will do just about anything our customers ask us to do if we can figure out a way to do it. But if we do it, we do it with robots. So everything you touch is, is you're, you're working with robots no matter what you do, right? Yep. Absolutely. All right, so you get done with your certification exam. It's only Sunday. What are some of the other things you're looking forward to here at 3D Experience World 2020? Oh man, being the first year, I'm not quite sure. Uh, there's so much going on. There's so many different classes that pique my interest. I have alternate on top of alternate of things that I want to go check out. So one of the really cool things that we're going to have is we have an event off-site on Tuesday night. It's going to be right out here in downtown Nashville. You'll get a really cool opportunity to, to see the heart of Nashville and engage with you know thousands of SolidWorks users that are going to be here at the event. There's all sorts of training activities that you're going to be able to participate in. Being your first event, I think it's going to be a really cool time for you. Yeah, absolutely. I don't know how I'm going to fit everything in I want to do. That's always the hard part and why people keep coming back. They always want to learn more. Well, Tony, I want to thank you for taking a few minutes out of your day to uh, sit and chat with us before you take your certification. I wish you the best of luck. And uh, once you get done, I can't wait to see you get that certified SolidWorks expert exam done. Thank you. My pleasure. All right. Take care. I'm here with Mike Puckett, the Senior Certification Manager for SolidWorks. Mike, how are you doing? Uh, good, it's been a busy morning, but things are off to a good start. Every year, 3D Experience World certifications is always a hot place where people want to be on Sunday morning. Tell us a little bit about this year. What you know? What do the numbers look like? You have a lot of people showing up. I saw there was a line out here this morning. We were actually over overbooked this morning. Uh, so luckily we didn't have to offer anybody like any free trips or anything. Uh, we, had, we had a few no-shows, so we were able to, to get everybody seated. Uh, so we're, so we're yeah, definitely fully booked this morning, pretty good this afternoon as well, and we have a couple of new exams that we're offering as well. 
So tell us a little, tell the folks at home a little bit about that, some of the new exams you are offering, but you're also doing something unique this year with certifications at 3D Experience World, right? Yeah, we'll start with a new exam. So we're um, we're offering our second uh, 3D Experience platform exam, which is based on the collaborative industry innovator role um, that SOLIDWORKS users will, will want to use. Um, so we're introducing that this year. Um, and then also we uh, have a couple of our exams that we launched this year, CAM, some other ones. Uh, the big news for us actually is that we are running for the first time ever a web-based tester client so completely in a browser in the cloud in the room right behind us um, our developers here on site helping to make sure that it goes live he's been um, he's been a little nervous and sweaty in the last couple of days but um, it's it's a big leap forward for us to be able to deliver uh, exams uh, in a browser and get rid of the Windows client that uh, plagues us sometimes with um, uh, antivirus stuff like that and my understanding is you're actually running this on the 3D Experience platform, correct? Yeah, and that's the entire goal is um, last year when we left here, I, I charged my team with the task of coming here this year and de delivering exams on the 3D Experience platform. Um, and they did a good job. They stepped up to the plate. They made it happen. And we're um, in the room over here where they're doing the 3D Experience exams. They're delivering exams on the 3D Experience platform for the first time ever. So this is great. So not only are the attendees here at 3D Experience World getting to take this new certification, they're getting exposure to the 3D Experience platform, and they're also walking away, I assume they're going to be registered with a 3D Experience ID as well? Yeah, they're all in, ready to go, and a lot of the people, uh, a lot of the, uh, when they finish, when they come out, they're saying that they, they love the content that's in there, they, they're glad to see it like uncovered in a different way, and, and learning stuff about it that they didn't know previously. And a few people have asked us uh, who they talked to to go buy it, so that's always good for us. This is my 11th year as an employee, managing for about six years now. Okay, so in that time, how many certified users are there out there now? We always look at this number and it grows every year. Give us an idea of what we're, we're looking at when employers are looking at potential employees. How many certified users are out there in the, in the market? So this, um, probably in the last couple of weeks, we passed um, the 420,000 mark. Which is, um, so it's, it's just pretty exciting because we're getting close to 500,000 or half a million as we like to say. Yeah. Um, last year we issued 81,000 new certifications and so that was a huge year for us. 33% growth over the year before. Um, so it's, it's exciting. It's, it's a big community that's growing rapidly. So without, with looking at those numbers by next year when we come here and talk to you again, you'll easily have eclipsed half a million certified users out there. Yeah, I, I guess for, the, for theatric reasons, it would have been nice if we could have passed it at 3D Experience World 2021, but we'll probably hit it sometime, I'm guessing around, we're taking bets on the team, probably October, November uh, is when it, we'll probably hit it. Well, I'll have to get with you after uh, we do this interview and get in on that pool. Yeah, so. I, I gotta figure out the odds and stuff. <laughs> So what are some of the other things you're excited about at 3D Experience World this year? You know, whether it's certifications or non-certified things, what are some of the other things you're looking forward to here? I'm learning more about the, uh, the, the, works, the works products. Um, at heart, I'm still an engineer at heart, and if, I love working for SolidWorks, don't get me wrong, but I miss making stuff when, when I used to be a mold designer. Um, and some of the new stuff that's coming out of these works products is just like, I could see myself using, especially the collaboration stuff. Um, in, on the platform and then some of the like simulation tools and also with the, uh, the the manufacturing tools that we just didn't we never had access to before yeah I'm really excited we always get the opportunity with the shop floor in the partner mm -hmm. playground you know Mike Bookley is going to be there and they're going to be taking a, an entire design all the way from initial concept through manufacturing using all the SolidWorks or the 3D Experience Works products in that entire process. That should be a really cool thing to go check out. Yeah, I can't decide if who has the better job at SolidWorks, you or Mike. Mike gets to play around with all these cool machines and you get to talk to a bunch of cool customers. So I'm still trying to figure out whose job I want to go for next. Well, I'll tell you what. Wait, whose job when, you're going you to retire, go for next? When you retire. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see yeah. how it is. Yeah. All right, Mike, well, I want to thank you for taking time out of our day. I know this is always a really busy schedule and you've got another whole group of people that are going to be coming through here later on this afternoon. So I, I know you're going to be busy all day. Yeah, and then tomorrow night we have the expert event too, so. so. Oh, can you tell us a little bit about what uh, yeah. users who are certified SolidWorks expert can expect on Monday night? Yeah, it's actually the, the 10th anniversary of CSWE. Um, so we're proud to be celebrating that. It went by fast. I was the original author of CSWE, so I get CSDB number one on my back. Um, and so we have, uh, we have shirts, we have coffee mugs, we have um, earbuds that are designed in SolidWorks from SolidWorks customer to give all of the experts that are here in attendance. And then we have a, a big party set up for them for tomorrow night. 
Can we tell town. the folks who are on live where that big party is yeah, going to be at? It's at HQ. It's a place called HQ Beercade. It's a bar with a bunch of video games, and then there's a really odd wall behind the DJ with 13,000 cassette tapes on it that oh. they say you're allowed to take if you want. So um, admission has a price, and it's the CS it's the CSWE ribbon. So, so I don't have my ribbons on right now. I'm yep. CSWE, and I'm really looking forward to this event. Uh, yeah. They're always a really good time. Get to touch base with a lot of old friends there mm -hmm. at the event, and you always put on. Uh, it's, a, it's, it's we'll call it a party. Yeah, we. I mean, we have to. The people, the, the people that uh, have earned it deserve it, and uh, it's the least that we can do for them coming out here and and helping to you know really promote our brand. All right. Well, Mike, again, I want to thank you for taking time out of your day to chat with all the folks on SolidWorks Live. So again, anybody watching at home, stay tuned. We're going to be broadcasting the entirety of 3D Experience World 2020.